Last week, President Donald Trump made history by becoming the first sitting president to attend the March for Life. And on that same historic day, the Trump administration announced it will take action against California for discriminating against organizations that do not cover abortion in their employee health care plans. The Trump administration also granted the state of Texas a Medicaid waiver to fund the Healthy Texas Women program, which does not include Planned Parenthood. These are all huge accomplishments for the pro-life movement, and that brings us to this week's call to action. Go to ProLifeWeekly.com to thank President Donald Trump for attending the March for Life and for taking pro-life action in California and Texas. Once you get to ProLifeWeekly.com, all you will do is type in some basic information so we can tailor this message directly to President Trump and his administration. Again, last week, President Trump became the first president in history to attend the March for Life, and he also made major pro-life strides. His presence at the largest pro-life event in the world forced more media attention and set a new precedent for future pro-life administrations. To send your thank you to President Trump, go to ProLifeWeekly.com.